TFNN. Headline News Update. Hi, everyone. Basil Chapman. This is the TFNN Update. This is the noontime update, and I'm the host of the Tiger Technicians Hour and the opening call, Daddy Newsletter, Comprehensive Newsletter, coming up straight after this update. Dow is up 168 points after the Good Jobs Report, 26,476, still quite a bit underneath the 26,695 recent high on the 23rd of March. You'll be watching this very closely. The technicals are still quite weak. So let's see how this pans out within the next two days coming up on Tuesday. If on Tuesday we start to test the 26,350 area, uh, that's going to mean that uh, lower lows and lower highs in the foreseeable future, at least for a short while. But if there is a push into the 26,530s by Monday, I have to admit that's really good action. And look, the S&P at this particular moment uh, is actually uh, a little bit better in terms of the recent high of 2949.52 and the low that was made yesterday just at about 20, 2900 because now it is more than halfway between the two so a 2940.24 ha huh, that was the that was the high of september uh, so we're back there. This is good action so far. Watch this closely and moving to the 2948.52 area would be really good action if it's by Monday or Tuesday. Any pullback, yes, says the day's low will be very important to close below 2929 in the next two days would not be very good. QQQ, NDX 100 trading vehicle right up against resistance at 190.39, up 2.30. A lot has to do with uh, Buffett talking about um, having a position uh, in Amazon. So we'll see what happens there. But in the meantime, it is under what it was underneath the 191.32 uh, recent high of the 28th. IWM is actually turning out to be a little bit better. It's breaking out and it could, in fact, be a little bit of a leader. I think the IWM has a chance now to play catch up as some of the others have a little bit um, uh, maybe not weakness, but they don't act as strongly. But most importantly, we were looking at Gold, which is having a nice move up based on the dollar activity uh, with the Fed. So it's up eight and the dollar right now. So eight at 12.80, it still doesn't look great. But the DXY has pulled back quite sharply, but still pretty good at 97.57. I'll talk more about this, talk about crude oil and all the other things that are important. As soon as we get back for my show, the Tiger Technicians Hour, then you get Steve Rhodes, Dave White and Tom O'Brien wraps it up for the week. Have a great day. Have a great day.